Hello, this is Chris Menard. Let me show you how to use conditional formatting so every fifth row has a background color to it. So this is what I'm going to end up with. And before I do this, let me show you how conditional formatting works. If you want to do every other row, I already have a video on this, but I'll cover it real quick. Also, just feel free to reference the table of contents, which I'll put on the screen. So highlight all your data. If I want every other row to be a different color, conditional formatting, new rule, formula, and your formula is equals MOD. The MOD formula has two arguments, row, comma, two, equals zero. What I'm saying is the row function basically tells you what row you're in. So by default, ROD, that's row two, three, four, Mod is 2 divided by 2. What's the remainder? 0. And I'm going to go put that in a green color. And there I go. If I want to edit the rule, notice it's row 2 and 4, 6. Now I'm going to go make it 1. Watch them swap from 2 to 3. Cool? But what somebody wanted to do is make every fifth row have a condition. So what they initially had was this. Row 5, row 10, row 15, row 20. The problem they had was row 1 is the header row. So really 2 is 1, 3 is 2, 4 is 3, and 5 is 4. So they really wanted to be row 6 and 11. So I told them just to change their conditional formatting. So row 6 divided by 5, the remainder would be 1. And that will take care of this issue right there. So there it is one more time. If you want every fifth row of data to have a condition, that's your conditional formatting formula to use. Hopefully that helps. Thank you.